Okay, so I need, I need to get some measurements for my robot. So I got a little pad of paper, I got a pen here. Okay, and let me show you how I'm going to do it on the screen here. I hope you can see it. It's kind of tough on the video there, but I'm gonna go over to this one that looks like six blocks there, and I think it says, yeah, it says port view. I'm gonna tap on port view, and then I'm going to go up, over. So I get one of my motors here, okay? So that's my left motor. I'm just, and so now, if I move my left motor, like this, you can see the numbers changes here. It tells me how many degrees rotation that is. So let me take that back down to zero. Let me reset that. Port view, go up and get it again. Okay, so I've got, and, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do here, and then I'm going to drive it forward to where I think I need to turn, to right there. Okay, that's 692 degrees. So I'm just gonna go, so that's forward, 692. Okay, then I'm going to go over to my other port. I'm going to go back so it clears, come back into it again. This time I'm going to go on my right motor. So I'm going to come over here and I want to show the right motor. Now with my hand, I'm just, with my finger, I'm just going to just turn the right motor until it lines up there. Okay, so that looks to me like I'm going to do a left turn 168 degrees. Okay, now you've got to do this on your end because my robot might not give you the same numbers, okay? I mean, you could cheat, I guess, and use these numbers, but you won't learn how to do it for all these other missions, so you should probably do the same thing, know how to read the screen there. Okay, so now that I've got there, I'm going to go back again and then come back into port view, go up and select either one of the motors because we're going to go forward, and then just with the whole robot, I'm just going to push it forward until it gets, I want this red bar to be vertical, perfectly vertical. So that is forward 425 degrees. Okay, so that's what I've got right now and I'm going to now program that in and we're going to see if that works and then we'll worry about getting the robot back.